pilots who perform emergency ejections from their aircraft can face repercussions, including being barred from flying fighter jets. Ejection seats have a two-step mechanism. The pilot activates the ejection gun by pulling a handle, which lifts the seat out of the plane, and then a rocket propels the pilot and seat upwards. However, the second phase of ejection subjects the pilot to a gravitational force 14 to 16 times stronger than normal, causing severe injuries. These injuries range from air blast bruises to leg fractures and neck injuries. Approximately 30% of pilots who eject may sustain spinal fractures, which can lead to a medical disqualification from flying fighter jets again.